You know, just as we finished having a good laugh over what a tiny incremental improvement Intel 14th gen was, Intel had to do it again. Well, okay, okay, not officially yet, but we have already seen the very first leaks of an alleged Intel 4900KS. Because if you thought that Team Blue's quest to squeeze every single megahertz out of Rapid Lake Silicon is over, well, you're wrong. And while we don't know too much about performance just yet, we do know that it's apparently going to be sitting at 6.2 gigahertz, or a 200 megahertz improvement over the 4900K. Now that should be a pretty nice and maybe even noticeable improvement in many use cases, but the thing with the CPUs is that the price you usually pay for the KS is almost never worth it. What's more, if you thought that Intel 14 gen was already pretty hard to cool, well, you've seen nothing yet, because this CPU is set to have a TDP of 150 watts. At this rate, by the end of 2024, the FX9590 will look conservative with its DDP. Now, apart from that, we don't have much else, but I don't think that really matters, because I don't think too many people will actually be interested in this CPU. It's more of a stopgap product to remind people that they still make high-end CPUs, and to once again try and win back the performance crown from AMD, which, granted, they had some success with with 14th gen already. But what do you think about all of this, and are you getting a 1400KS? Well, let me know down in the comments below, and while I stay here, maybe also check out our Patreon, because even a single dollar a month truly goes a long way, plus huge thanks to Gun Burns, Justin Rage, Ella Ronyak, Patrick Boker, not a pseudonym, Meg Sumner, Shin Allcroft, Lansby, and Level Up. But anyway, that's it. It's, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did that, remember to subscribe, like, whatever, and I'll see you all in whatever I make next. Goodbye, everyone. Good. Bye.